everyone, I'm Priyanka and I'm a qualified counsellor at Oasis Group. I'm very excited to let you know that I'm in a very interesting campus of Torrance University and today we have Barbie who is Business Development Manager of Torrance University. Thank you so much for making time for us Barbie today. Thank you Priyanka for coming out to see Torrance University. We are grateful to have you here. So today we'll be talking about IT courses offered by Torrance University. Now Torrance University has courses like Bachelor's of Software Engineering majoring in Artificial Intelligence, Master of Software Engineering majoring in Artificial Intelligence, also Master of Business Information System. So Barbie will be telling us more about this course. So to start with Barbie, what about Bachelor's of Software Engineering in Artificial Intelligence? So what is the entry requirement of this course? Okay, so for the Bachelor program, we would need to have a Year 12 certificate plus an IELTS 6.0 in English mm -hmm. and no bands less than 5.5. Okay, so it looks pretty simple. Yeah. So you just need to have Year 12 and an English of 6 overall, no band less than 5.5. How about the fee, Barbie? Is it a little expensive compared to other courses? Uh, for the bachelor, we're looking at 30,000 per year. Uh -huh. Okay. For the uh, master's program, it's the same price. Yes. So with bachelors, uh, bachelors of software engineering, majoring in artificial intelligence are for those who have just graduated from year 12. Now if you're looking at a master's level, you're looking at doing a master's of software engineering, uh, majoring in artificial intelligence, which again goes like same fee of $30,000. Is there any difference between entry requirement bar before master's? Okay, so for the master's program, you would need to have an English level mm -hmm. of IELTS 6.5 and no bands less than 6.0. Okay. Plus you need to have an uh, undergraduate. Undergraduate. Okay, now moving on, they also have a course called Masters of Business Information System. Now it is also related to IT. Now let's know with Barbie, how is it different from doing a Master of Software Engineering and doing Master of Business Information Systems? Is it a little different going to yeah, this course? Yeah, so uh, for the uh, MBIS, mm -hmm. this would be for someone who maybe is not, has a fully IT background, mm -hmm. maybe someone who has more of a business background because this program is where we can combine um, IT and business together. Okay, so basically people who do not really have a direct or cognitive background in IT can go for MBIS. And again, assuming the entry requirement is gonna be the same for master, which is 6.5, no less than six. Correct. And bachelors can be in any discipline and then you can move ahead with MBIS. And uh, now with COVID really, Barbie, what do you think, uh, how has it impacted the students? Okay, well, at the moment, we are delivering our programs online. Mm -hmm. So this is a very full interactive uh, way to mm -hmm. study. So the way that we would study in the classroom, we have managed to put the program together uh, in a program called Blackboard. Okay. And this is where the students would interact with their teacher and the students in their class. So okay. they will be able to communicate in a group environment, mm -hmm. um, share and collaborate together, upload assignments, everything in this platform. Okay, and I also uh, heard a lot of feedback from students. Uh, they are finding it very easy to study online because they're students who are shy. Mm -hmm. So they are, it's easy for them to ask questions. So of course, it's a good way. Now, we also get a lot of questions in terms of, you know, students are finding it financial difficulties during this time. So is there any scholarship that students are getting, uh, are it's available for students to uh, avail? Yes, so at the moment we have a really good scholarship. It's a 25% scholarship mm -hmm. for our summer program. Okay. So anyone who wants to take advantage mm -hmm. of this, um, they can enroll for the November intake, which is only a few weeks away. Okay. Um, and we can automatically give them the 25% scholarship. So if you guys are willing to study this course, this is the right time to really get in touch with us and we can help you getting the admission in Torrance University with 25% scholarship. So just get in touch with our admission consultants and we'll be more than happy to help you.